And what if it didn't kill him? With all due respect, your best guess is still just a guess. We need to have faith in the possibility of good. Wait, hold on. His oxygen consumption's going up. I think he's alive. He's conscious. Hey, go steady down there. You've been out for a couple weeks. Fifteen days, in fact. They thought you were dead. If it wasn't for your life suit, you probably would be. Listen, there's been a complication. We can't link it to your POV camera, and it looks like communications are only working one way. You can hear me, I hope, but I can't hear you. That means we don't know how badly you were affected by the transportation. If you're feeling confused or disoriented, you should know that deep space travel can do you pretty serious psychological damage, especially to your memory. Even a few hours out there in the dark can cause permanent problems. I'm gonna be honest with you. Mission controller concerned you might have no idea who you are or why you're in there. If that's true, I have some difficult facts for you. You're a long way from Earth, a very long way. But every single person on the planet is depending on you. That thing you're inside right now, whatever it is, is gonna hit Earth in the next few hours. And if it does, that's the end of everything. You need to decipher and dismantle it from the inside before that happens. I just hope you haven't forgotten how. We all do. Now listen carefully. This is important. The reason why it's me talking to you and not mission control is because you're too far out into deep space. Their signal can't reach you out there, but mine can. I'm Commander Novak. I'm an astronaut on board the International Space Station. I'm gonna relay everything they tell me, but the bad news is, every time I orbit around the far side of the Earth, I'll move out of radio range. When that happens, you're gonna be on your own for a while. Just stay calm, and keep your head straight until I get back into range. Okay, this is it. I'm orbiting out of range now. I'll be back soon. Just remember what I've told you, and believe it. Well, hey everybody, you know this is why I just we're back here with another video. Let's get right to the video. Oh yeah, how guys, gals, everything in between. Welcome to a new lovely video, and today we're playing uh, an old game, like eight years old, I believe, called Cubed. And I'm playing the director's cut, so let's see. Oh, okay, that's nice. I don't know what type of game this is supposed to. Be, but we're for the fun with it, you know. It reminded me of Portal, even though this came out before Portal. It's a fun part. Oh. <laughs> my little Christmas break, taking my two weeks off for uh, Christmas break and New Year's. Actually, um, how have y'all been? I can't support Christmas break. Oh, I don't know what this building is, and it terrifies me. Because all the symmetry, all the great. The trailer was something more terrifying. I'm saying this is an old game. Am I moving or is it? I don't know this point. Pretty sure I'm moving. Is there a phone? Oh, it's getting darker. I don't like dark. Where am I going? Why is this the darkest part? Is that a crouch? Okay. I think I'm just going to trust this wherever it takes me. Ah, that's. 
do and boom, okay. Up, so I don't have to automatically touch them. All right, he, yeah. Okay, if I jump, yeah, there we go. Perfect dismount. All right, what does yellow do? fun to do because I'm not that good at it. Okay. But I'm getting up oh, that ah, I fell off. <laughs> but I am getting the hang of this game. It's so much fun. For me. Oh, yeah, we're gonna cut that part out. Achievement unlock. Quick understanding of explorer modes. Okay. I wanna say it's like a real quick understanding. It's more or less I'm learning as I go. Technically, anything a good idea? Figure. Oh. Hmm. Uh, yes. Oh. Almost, but not quite enough. Oof, to get me. 
Okay, let's see. This is gonna look very much impressive because I'm getting stuck right here. But yeah, make you the tallest, which I won't be able to use that at all. But it will give me up here. Uh, okay, I see what I gotta do. second I had it. Yes. I'm a problem solver. Got the job done and oh. Okay, how far can I reach you? Oh, what the fuck? I don't know what that was I don't know what that was on. Complete. Alright. All right, Alright. I think I can cut this thing into like six videos. But let's just see the interest of here. Okay, green. I was not interested in you yet. I guess I can't do anything with green. Wait, what? Oh, I guess it just transport. Video. Nope. Okay. Okay. Eh. Back. Um. Uh, well, guys, I think that should be good for this video. I hope y'all enjoy. I hope, ugh. I hope y'all like, comment, share, subscribe, and I hope y'all enjoy the video that I've made today. Cause this actually looks like something I can get into. It's a little puzzle solving game, you know, something to tease my little brain, and also so my viewers can laugh at me. But anyway, thank y'all guys for watching the video. Be like, comment, subscribe, and don't forget, I'm on a road before I graduate in 2023 of May. I'm on a road to get a thousand subscribers. That's all I want from y'all. Currently, that's all I want. I even have a reward if I make it to that goal by the end of May of 2023. Remember, the goal is I eat pepper, I eat hot peppers, I eat a lot of spices, and even drink lemonade. While wrapping Rap God, the fast part Rap God, not the whole thing, you know, on a live stream, and also doing Buzz Around Fast part of Yellow and Ricky. So please, if y'all can't get me to a thousand subscribers, I will do it. Anyway, I hope y'all enjoy the video, and goodbye, people.
and hope you enjoy. I almost said that. I almost did somebody else's outro. <laughs> All right. Bye, people.